Global Solution TV. We got your solution. Yes, dear viewers, we are back on our show, Solution Tips, where solutions session, and medications My dear viewers, we are talking about honey, how honey can be used to add, to bring taste. Whether you've been rejected, you've been having a playing job and you've been jobless, honey can be used to bring taste to your name, to your life one more. Those people having so problems with marriages, we are having honey here. It can bring solution to your problem. Today we are having in our own and we are still having him in. So guys, tune in and tune more. I need more questions in here. Doctor, welcome once more. Thank you, thank you. Yes. And I'm seeing two more recipes uh, that are here. I see a native egg. How can it be used? Yeah, uh, Carol, a native egg has a lot of, uh, a lot of uh, benefit. Uh -huh. uh, yeah, uh, a lot of benefit spiritually. Yes, yes, yes. Just that uh, we have been... Uh, uh, blind, uh -huh. blinded, where we see uh, people using it for negative things only. Yes. Especially when you go to a witch doctor uh -huh. or and all these uh, uh, people, native doctors. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, those who have uh, a bad intention. Yeah. Or yeah. maybe you want to do something bad to against somebody. somebody. Yeah. Now you go to them and they will give you this uh, native egg. Uh -huh. But uh, a native egg, I want to tell you, it is a very, very powerful uh, weapon that it can benefit a lot of Christian, a lot of Muslim, uh -huh. anybody that is a human being, uh -huh. they can use a native egg. Yes. And it will be a blessing in their life. Uh -huh. I will give you some few tips that you can do with a native egg and it's acceptable in the realm of the spirit yes. and God will back up the point. Uh -huh. Uh, it doesn't matter. An egg is just a product of the hen. Yes. And these are things that we have in the kitchen. Yeah. We have in our home. Yes. We keep them. A lot of people are using egg. They are selling them in yeah. their shops. Yes. Egg is just an egg. We have a Greek egg. Yes. We have the native one. Yes. Now, I have listened to other people when they say an egg is an egg. You can use any recipe with any egg. Mm -hmm. Actually, the truth of the matter is that the agric one yes. is limited. Yeah. It cannot do some other some levels of services. Yeah. Different problems you want to solve in life spiritually, they have different levels. Yes. They are caused with different powers. Yeah. Yeah. Some yeah. demons are chiefs. Yeah. Some are senior chiefs. Meaning they have, gr they they have graduated. Have they have different powers. Yeah, they and they, as they, they have a rank, yeah. as a level yeah. in that position, uh -huh. they also have that much power yes. to do that responsibility they are assigned to. Uh -huh. So there are things that a native egg can do, yes. which uh, a, a negro egg cannot do. Mm -hmm. And therefore, it's a good thing that on this channel, yes. Uh, people will learn to know that my, you, you are people now, I believe they will know yes. that there are different levels yes. of solving problem with a native egg. Yes. There are things that you can do. For example, um, if somebody has stolen yes. something, a property from somewhere, yes. if somebody has stolen from your house yeah, or from your shop, uh, thieves, yes. not robbers. The thieves. Robbers are the people that will tell you, give, give to us. Mm -hmm. It's by force. By force yes. They are called uh, armed robbers. Yes. The armed men. They come with the arm, they yeah. snatch it by force from you. And they even by sometimes the kill you, yes. The thieves, they look around when you are not there. Yeah. They can break in and take it. When you see them, they run away. Those are called thieves. thieves. But yeah. robbers yes. are those who force you. Whether they find you or not, you give it to them. These are robbers. Okay. They come to rob you. Yes. So I am talking about thieves. Okay. If a thief snatch something from the position where you have put it, yes. whether it's money, whether it's an item, whether it's a property, whether it's big or small, yes. and that place should not be tempered for. Yeah. Like people don't touch that place. Uh -huh. When you find this thing is not here, yes. 
and now you don't touch that place. Uh -huh. Nobody should pass that place. Uh -huh. You surround it to mark it yes. and warn the people. Nobody should pass it. Yeah. And you yeah. know this. You can use an egg. Yes. Write the name of the thing that was stolen. Yes. Around huh? the egg. Yes. Around the egg. Okay. Get you. And place it on the point where that item was. Yes. Uh -huh. Then yes. do your prayers like... Let the person that took this thing return it within a certain source of period. You give a period. Or let the person become mad. Uh -huh. Or let the person come and kneel down and confess. Yes. Within a such a such a period. Okay. And you leave that uh -huh. egg for 24 hours yes. in that place. Okay. After 24 hours, you take the egg and you break it in that place. Uh, and make sure that, that nobody... Um, who watch at you. Nobody will, uh, uh, not, uh, I beg, make sure that uh, the water will not touch you okay. when it breaks. Okay. Once you break it, it has gone with the, in the realm of the spirit. Uh -huh. You weigh the result based on the words that you spoke. Okay. The Bible says a man shall fill his belly mm -hmm. by the fruit of his mouth. Wow. Amen. By your words, yes. you shall be judged. So, it is by your words you shall be condemned, and by your words you shall be justified. True. Based on what you have said, yes. and you take an action, mm -hmm. it shall be so. Amen. So, this means that all these things are accompanied by the words you speak. Words you speak uh -huh. are the words from the spirit. Yes. Words are spirit. Uh -huh. And there is no a spirit of the devil inside a man. Uh -huh. It is God's spirit inside a man. Okay. Where you speak, it uh -huh. is God's word. Yes. Especially if you, you are inspired by the, 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 the spirit of God. Yes. The man is created by God's spirit because the, the, the breath of a man is the, 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 is the light of God inside yes. them. And that is the Holy Spirit. Yes, yes. And therefore, Jesus said, my words gives life and my words are spirit. Mm -hmm. So the words that you speak is what determines what will happen. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So whenever, whichever the word you've spoken whenever, before you broke that egg, so yeah. that's what exactly going to happen. That's what will happen, and I affirm that by the words of God. Yes. I have just quoted Matthew 12 and verse, verse number 37. Yes. By your words, you shall be justified, yes. and by your words, you shall be condemned. Amen. Amen. Proverbs 13, verse 2. A man shall fill his belly by the fruit of his mouth. Okay. So the words we speak, dear viewers, knowledge is power. The words you speak, they have power to make you or to break you. So be sensitive in whatever you speak. Speak wisely because these words, they make you. Servant of God, apart from uh, somebody has stolen your things, how can we use again the egg to bring a solution to our daily basis? So it depends on what solution. Yes. Because every solution, okay. it has a, a, a dimension of how you can solve it. Uh -huh. in that egg. Yes. But I just gave you, for example, if somebody has stolen, mm -hmm. and you want the person to return it. Yes. That's what you can do. Mm -hmm. Now, you want to destroy uh, problems in your life. Yes. Maybe you have a witchcraft in your body. Yes. You are walking around with a mark of witchcraft. You don't know what to do. Anything you touch, you come negative. Yeah. You have those problems like that. Bad luck, yeah. things like that. You can use an egg. Yes. You touch on your body everywhere. Yeah. And then you break it outside your compound. Okay. Break it outside your, outside compound. your compound. When you do that, Words of your mouth you spoke on that, mm -hmm. it has broken the curses over your life. Yes. You can break those negative energies, those bad lucks that are following you, those unfortunate, mm -hmm. and then you will see that your life begin to welcome good lucks on your life. Okay. Again, if you have a chronic disease, maybe it's a spiritual a disease or a spell that yes. people are put on you yeah. in the manner of sickness. Uh -huh. You can still use an egg, you touch it on yourself and you speak words and then you have to return it or right surround your head three times. Uh -huh. Negative. You have to go this way. Don't go clockwise. Yes, you go anti-clockwise three times. If you are removing something in your body, yes. you are breaking sickness, spiritual disease like that. You go and clockwise three times and you say what you want uh -huh. and you break it again outside the compound. Yeah. When you break it, you start coming back. Do not look back. Uh 
Uh-huh. Yeah, and again, don't allow the water to touch you. To touch you. That's one you can solve with an egg. Yeah. He has the many things he can do. Uh-huh. Yeah. He has the many things he can do in the spiritual realm. We can benefit a lot from the native egg. So my dear viewers, wherever you are, you have a chronic disease, whether diabetes, mellitus, whether hypertension, arthritis, whichever the sickness, whichever the curses you are having, Native Egg has brought a solution to us. I believe you are listening to Dr. He is here with us in the studio. I believe you are getting us wherever you are. Kindly keep on tuning in, keep on listening to this, because these are the answers to our very daily basis uh, situation. Uh, and also to say that, to add on that, uh, Carolina. Yes. Uh, you see, you can use the native egg to transfer uh -huh. uh, the problem that you have to somebody else. Again, from you to somebody else? You can use it to somebody uh, How? How, sir? Like, um, if you touch on yourself, yes. you touch like that, everything, and you speak, uh -huh. you, those things that are uh, di decide, di 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 uh, disturbing you yes. everywhere, and then you place it on the road. Yes. You don't break it. Uh -huh. You place it on the road. Uh, mm -hmm. Anyone, the first person that will jump it, uh -huh. whether they touch it or not, so long as they pass that road, uh -huh. they jump it. They carry it. Those things will follow the person. On this side, you yes. begin to revive. Uh, or you begin to see good things. On the other side, negative, negative things will follow the person. Actually, you have transferred the problem that was with you. Uh -huh. It goes with the wind, the person that jumped that egg. That is a very, very effective and very powerful with an egg. Wow. So this means for somebody who has, maybe, uh, who has cast a spell on somebody. Uh -huh. So somebody can touch this, uh, touch all over his body and take it, put it somewhere. So, but again, this can be a bit risky because you might put near and your own children, maybe take it again. That's so. why you need to have good intention with a human being. Yeah. You don't need to intend to destroy people with a wrist piece. Uh -huh. You need to do good. Yes. Yeah. That's why you need to do good because anyone that plan evil, Yes. Evil will return to the person. Back to him. Yeah. I, I get I'm it. just giving information. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, this knowledge is so precious, so, so precious, so, so precious. Don't miss this. Don't miss this. So are we done with the using the native ego? The, I believe there are more. You are too knowledgeable about this <laughs> natural recipe. A church yes. that people are not coming. A uh -huh. pastor is watching me. Yes. You people that are telling me. I have a lot of pastors, a lot of ministers who are yes. sending to me messages. A man of God, I started a church 20 years ago, 10 years ago, yes. 5 years ago, 3 years ago. I am struggling, people are not coming, 18 people in five years. Mm -hmm. You can use an egg, yes. pray over it and break on the altar. Yes. People will call you a witch, but you are not doing witchcraft. What you are doing, you are trying to solve a problem yeah. in the name of God. Mm -hmm. You see what the Bible says in Colossians 3, uh, uh, 7, yes. I beg 17. Yes. It says, whatever you do in action or in words, uh -huh. do it in the name of Jesus. Jesus. So you as a pastor, you can do it in the name of Jesus. Break it on the altar. Yes. Break it in the church. Yes. Claiming people to come. Whatever curses that are on the ground to look people to come in that place. There are places where pastors have rented. Yes. In those places, people have put some altars. Yeah, the foundational altars, yes. People will never come home. Yeah. Or people come, they don't give at all. Yes. They don't give at all. Or negative things are in that church. People quarrel with one another. People are not getting married. Yeah. People are not getting blessing. Mm -hmm. You can break, pray with an egg, break when people are not there. Yeah. Break it on the ground. Uh -huh. You can use the same thing to solve that case. And people, you see that if severally, you don't do once. Yes. You can be doing that uh, once in every week, once every, gradually you will begin to see changes okay. in, the, in your ministry. Whether it's a business, you can call people using the same. Yes. The same strategy with the business. The same strategy with the hotel business, mm -hmm. the people with the shops, yes. people with the, those who want people to come and buy things from them. Yes. You use that. My it's a very dear, powerful solution. My dear viewers, my dear viewers, see, don't miss this. You have a lot of things. Don't miss this. Don't miss this. Don't miss this. You have a business that is troubling you in a coma. You don't have customers. People think your things expire. Because doctors have seen people having shops and their things do expire. They have, at yeah. the end of the month, they throw them, they go at a loss. And some have taken from maybe a loan from a microfinance office. At the end of the day, the auctioneers are coming. So this is a solution. My dear viewer, wherever you're listening us from, 
don't miss this use this native egg it's gonna be a solution to you then doctor i believe there are more to expose uh, to tell us more i will get you back to the studio one of these fine days we have a felt pen here felt pen this green pen how can it be used or how do we use it this one um uh my fellow daughter yes sir. this one yes. you just uh, need to if you want good things to come to you good luck yes you want to open a door somewhere maybe you want to go to america and they are denying visa yes you write america here you use a green pen yes a green uh -huh. is a color of the the earth the yes. motherland yes yes, yes. it's a color of a motherland yes yes it means life Yes. It means go ahead, uh -huh. it means success, uh -huh. it means prosperity, it means yes. good things. Yes. So you use a green pen, uh -huh. you write on the egg, yes. that you want the door to open up, you want those... This same native egg. Same egg. Yes. You can write it here, you write the country you want to go. Yes. And then you write what you want uh, to get, like a visa, yes. or American visa, uh -huh. uh, German visa, yes. like that. Uh -huh. And then you pray over it over the egg yes father in the name of jesus mm -hmm. as i prayed with the egg mm -hmm. i prayed that my door will open up uh -huh. you go and break it yes. go and break it daytime daytime go and break it there are people that will tell you that any service you do with an egg you have to break in the night uh -huh. the answer is no uh -huh. my names are dr wilson tayo mm -hmm. i am not speaking from knowledge only yes i also speak by revelation yes and i have experience yes there are services that demand daytime and there are services that demand night times yes so this type of uh, opening a door for getting a visa yes. you don't need to struggle in the night uh -huh. you need to break the egg daytime when from midnight midday, midday. Uh, this is 12 p.m or 12 noon yes. to 3 p.m yes. you break the egg uh -huh. once you break you say as it has broken uh -huh. my door is open. open i received a visa mm -hmm. it will come to you uh -huh. whether it's a white man sitting on that denying you the person will be provoked by the spirit yes. and when you appear there they will call your name okay yes. so my dear viewers if you are there struggling i've seen people with their visas they've been stuck somewhere you've applied your passport and your things are not going through some are applying them and they're getting so faster the solution is here you use this same native egg you write whatever the problem is that passport where you want to go and break it as doctor has said so we have a solution in the house i'm your host still carolina oh doctor in summary this native egg have we exhausted all because i want this my viewers you can know. you can cover the session with yes. uh, even this uh, egg uh -huh. he has uh, more than a hundred uh, ways on yes. how to use it okay he has a lot mm -hmm. it's only that um uh, you people you give me a very short time because uh, my time is almost, it is almost uh, yeah so but there are several things you can do with an egg yes. for instance a woman came to me in my office yes. and she told me that her firstborn has been taken away uh -huh. by a witch doctor uh -huh. who is actually a neighbor in yes. the same same compound uh -huh. so the, he has taken out eight months Number two, her husband has separated for three years. Yes. The native doctor is the one that, a witch doctor, not a native doctor, because they are different. Yes. A witch doctor is the one that took away mm -hmm. that uh, husband. Yes. So when she came to me, uh, she cried. She says, she have prayed a lot. She have done a lot of things. Yes. You see? Yes. You know what I did? Uh -huh. I just told her, go and bring a native egg. And I prayed with a native egg. I gave her, I told her, go and break it. Yes. Where do you want? Do you want to kill a doctor, a native a witch, witch doctor, doctor? Or you want the witch doctor to move away from that place? She said, let the person move away. Yes. And then I told her, go and stretch it. Pull it somewhere. Break, throw it away from you. Yes. Because if you break it, the person will die. Yes. But if you throw it away, yes. the person will pack their things and move. Away from, okay, away from that place. Yes. And he did that. I told her within seven days it will be so. Wow. And it happened exactly like that. Amen. The, on the sixth day, yes. the seventh day in the evening, the yes. pastor packed up and go. Wow, glory to God. So you can use it. Amen. Yeah. Amen. My yeah. dear viewers, time is not on our side. 
doctor in two to three minutes can you tell us where can we find you on social media because there is a lot we have to cover but again i'm told time is not on our side can you tell us yeah. tell our viewers where we can find you on which social media we can find you so that they can click on subscribe and get and listen to more i'm a popular man I'm grateful to god this day that the lord has enabled us to have you in we'll create more time and get you back to the studio well. because these people need to get this knowledge because knowledge is power and it's gonna help them all <laughs> So Thank you so much. Yeah. Uh, you can find me on uh, on um, a YouTube channel. Yes. I have a YouTube channel, Global Solution for All Mankind. Yes. If you subscribe there, you'll find us a lot of uh, teaching, a lot of uh, disinformation is uh, almost there. Amen. Uh, also, you can go to a Facebook page. Yes. On a Facebook page, Global Solution for All Mankind. Yes. We have a page. You can find us there. You can write us an email, Kingdom Champion Ministry at gmail uh, at gmail dot com. Yes. That is an email you can you can send us a message, yes. or you can call our line. My line is a uh, plus two fifty four seven two two four seven two five nine one. That number is a correct direct line. You can call and find us in my office, wow. and I will be able to listen to you. I have a WhatsApp line also plus two five four seven uh, nine zero. Uh, then 970 yes. 454. Wow. That is a WhatsApp number. Yes. A lot of people are getting me on WhatsApp. Wow. You yes. can find us on that WhatsApp. Yes. I have a website uh, www.globalsolutionforallmankind.com. Uh, wow. You'll find me on that uh, website. Yes. You'll see a lot of information what we are doing and yes. all these products are uh, information as uh, services. Are there? I have a lot of services, yes. cleansing services, yes. um, restoration services, yes. destruction services whereby we destroy curses, yes. uh, death in the land, or powers of darkness in uh -huh. different homes. People build houses and they can't live in. Uh -huh. We destroy powers and yes. we allow people to come in okay. and live and abode, have peace with God. Wow. Yeah. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, thank you so much. We are really privileged to have you in here in the studio. Thank and we will create more time. We'll book, I believe next time we'll create more time so that you tell these viewers more and help them more. My dear viewers, what a precious day. We have the most unique servant of God. We've been having, we've been hosting him in here with us. Though time is not on our side. Next time, let's meet next time, same place. I'm your host, Carolina. I love you. Mwah. Have a good day. Global Solution TV, we got your solution.